Hi there. Let me give you a challenge today. What what exactly are you going to do in the class today? In all probability, there will definitely be an exercise with 20 to 30 questions that students have to do. So let me give you a strategy and you can try it out and see how it goes. Divide your class into small, small groups. Groups of maximum four to five, or if you have one of those humongous classes, you can even have groups of six each. Give one, one tough problem to each group to solve. And then let them have a certain amount of time, let's say seven minutes or eight minutes or six minutes or even four minutes. And ask the entire group to come together and solve it. Now remember, the class will be noisy, but it's constructive noise. Number two, the children will get really excited. They might stand, they might get around the table, allow that physical flexibility. Your job would be to only move from group to group to group and observe what they are doing. Are they working? Are they fighting? Are they copying? Most of the students would be very excitedly trying to do the sum. Now, once the time is up, ask each group, one person or two or the whole group, that's up to you. Ask them to come to the board and explain to the class, tell the class, this was our question and this is how we solved it. Now, once each group has done this and the class has had a discussion, I think by the time your lesson would be over. So you've got six questions done in the class by different groups of children. Now, what do you do next? The class will be really, really charged up and children are very charged up when they are given a task where they have to sit in groups and discuss something. So at the end of the class, give them a worksheet with those six questions that they did in the class, plus maybe six or maybe 10, if you're one of those really problem solving kind of teachers, 10 more and ask them to do those as homework. And then watch the magic that happens. I am pretty sure a lot of you students who never did maths, never liked it, never did any problem solving or were really slow in it, you will definitely find a change in them the next day. Try it out and then tell us how it went. Thank you so much from here, Humane Maths and happy teaching.